Well, I'm really proud, first of all, that Arkansas Children's was the second children's hospital in the country to have a Da Vinci robot. And so in, uh, when I started in 2010, uh, we, we began using it in urology, which previously it had not been used in, in our area. And, um, and then with the recruitment of Dr. Patel and Dr. Zamilpa in 2012, um, we rapidly adopted it and have implemented it. We've done around 500 cases with the Da Vinci robot, you know, far and away more than uh, many of the other pediatric institutions in the surrounding area. And um, you know, we, we've had great results Families have been really happy and, um, and it's made a big difference in terms of reducing scarring, reducing pain, um, and also enabling patients to get home quicker too, back to their families. Robotic surgery has made a big difference in pediatric urology, also just pediatric surgery in general. Um, we're able to work through really small incisions, uh, so uh, in order to do reconstructive procedures, um, sometimes if there's a tumor or or some other kind of problem that needs to be removed. Uh, so it's really good for small incisions, which leads to less pain and less scarring. And in general, first of all, when you're implementing technology, you have to make sure that you're achieving equivalent outcomes to open surgery, the alternative. And so, you know, I can attest to and, and, and vouch for that that is definitely the case. We track those outcomes. We've published about many of those surgeries. Along with that, safe delivery of care is equally as important. I mean, even if you achieve the same outcomes in terms of success of the surgery, um, you know, how do you make sure that what you're doing is safe? You know, because we're using you know, a robot that, you know, sometimes is, can be scary to patients or families. You know, I'm very proud to say we've had great results with minimal complications. And, uh, but regardless of all that, every time you're on the robot, every time you're in the operating room, it's, it's a new case and someone's precious child that you're taking care of. So all of that has to be new and fresh every time and that's the way we approach it. And I think that's why we've gotten really good results.